Hi everybody, it's Lois here. I'm going to read from a lovely book called Happy. This is about exploring your emotions and looking at the beautiful world around you. A children's book of mindfulness. Happy. Mindfulness. Mindfulness is about connecting with ourselves and the world around us. Let's take a journey together to discover some simple steps on the path to happiness. Real life is right under our noses. We can miss it by rushing around, but stopping to smell life's sweet roses is where true happiness can be found. Listening. When we're still, there is space then to listen to the sweet song of the wind in the trees, the gruff rumble of cars in the distance, or the whisper of rustling leaves. Listen to the sound effects. Have a guess at what you can hear. Feeling. Even the darkest storm passes. The sun can't shine bright every day. We can sit with our feelings and notice how they roll through us, then blow away. What kind of things make you feel happy? It might be spending time with your family or the people that you love. Or cuddling up on the sofa having a lovely hug. Or maybe even reading a book. Relaxing. It's not just our minds we get trapped in. Our bodies can feel tension too. We can loosen our limbs when that happens. Like the sun from the clouds, we break through. Try tensing up all of your muscles and then relaxing them one by one. Stretching, get it. Are you stretching, get it. Tasting. Whether hot, salty, sweet or sour flavour, we taste and we chew and we feel. If we slow when we eat, we can savour the deliciousness of every meal. Do you notice different textures and flavours when you chew your food slowly? Touching. Touch calms the wildest emotions. We connect to the world all around. When we dip our toes into the ocean or crunch crisp golden leaves on the ground. Close your eyes and see if you can tell what things are just by touching them. Or do you like playing with slime? Discovering. Exploring is one of life's pleasures. Spot a penny, a shell or a rook. The world's brimming with curious treasures for the people who take time to look. Look all around you and try to spot something you haven't noticed before. Looking for some. Smelling. When we're all tangled up in our worries, the cool air gets us grounded again. Wood smoke through the sharp tang of pine trees or the freshness of earth after rain. Do the things you can smell make you feel anything or bring back any memories? 
Loving. The warmth of a hug can work wonders. Being happy is something you feed. With a smile or a touch or a kindness, even the tallest tree grows from a seed. Have you given someone a hug or a smile today? Sometimes I get a good feeling. Appreciating. It feels good to give thanks at the day's end for the pink blushing sky overhead. A hot meal, comfy shoes or a good friend and the warmth of a soft, cosy bed. What good things have happened in your world today? <laughs> Breathing. We breathe deep and expand like the galaxy. We breathe out many thousands of stars. And if ever we start to feel panicky, this reminds us of just who we are. Take a deep breath. Hold it for two seconds and then breathe out very slowly. Happiness. Real life is right under our noses. It's what's here, not the future or past. Every day is a fresh new adventure. Now we live in the moment at last. How can you be more mindful each and every day?